No Film School's coverage of NAB is brought to you by Limelight, makers of professional lighting for independent filmmakers. My Road Reel International Film Contest. Enter at myroadreel.com. Uh, hey, this is Joe. I'm here with Steve at Panasonic, and he's going to introduce us to the uh, new Vericam line. Hey, thank you. Yes, this is our brand new Vericam 35. This is our first, first uh, Super 35 millimeter sensor camera. It's our first 4K camera, but it's not just a 4K camera. It also shoots 2K, also shoots HD, also shoots proxy, uh, has uncompressed raw outputs, uh, has real live 4K outputs. So it's an incredible camera, whether you're looking for cinema, uh, whether you're looking for episodic and dramatic production, or whether you're looking for live 4K production. So it's pretty exciting. Uh, show floor has been uh, packed here at NAB. Um, it's all, and it's a modular design where the front of the camera is the imager. This is where our 35 millimeter camera head is. The back of the camera is the recorder and the controller. And because it's modular, you, you connect them together. And of course, it could be split apart and you could put the camera up on a jib, on a dolly, on a crane have the recorder in the video village in the DIT area. That's pretty exciting. And we also came out with a complimentary two-thirds inch high-speed camera for people that are shooting sports, action, could be a second action camera on a major uh, dramatic production. But with this camera here, some of the really key points are uh, 120 frame uh, 4K. Um, the cool thing about it though is it's uh, no, no sacrifices in terms of its full resolution 4K. Um, so that's is that an that's an external recording, the 4K and 20 frames per second. Is that internal or that's actually that's... internal okay. with uh, AVC Ultra 4K. So internally you can record 4K on the main recorder, while simultaneously recording 2K and proxy on micro P2 cards. And you could apply a look to it. So essentially you can have uh, your in-camera dailies ready to take out or uh, ready for editing when you put your uh, 4K on the shelf. Uh, in terms of raw, we have a 4K uncompressed raw output. Uh, we have a collaboration with Codex. So um, yeah, 4K uncompressed. So for uh, a lot of the cinema shooters, they're gonna look at that. Uh, for people that are doing more episodic production, they're, we've heard from most of them that they're more interested in the ultra 4K or in ProRes. We also implemented uh, two flavors of ProRes in camera. Uh, ProRes HQ and uh, ProRes 4x4. So for those customers that like the ProRes workflow, we want to take advantage of the great look of the Vericam camera, they can shoot ProRes in HD or 2K. Right, so now this is a this is a rolling shutter, Super 35 sensor? It's a Super 35 sensor. Okay. Yes. And it's a rolling shutter? Technically, yes, it's a rolling shutter with a incredibly fast, uh, <laughs> fast yeah. data pull from the yeah. camera, so you get a really, uh, really good uh, quality video. Okay. And you've also got the built-in NDs here too, as well. Built-in everything on the camera, yes. Yeah. <laughs> now, price-wise, I know you announced sort of a package price so uh, far. The, for the front end of the camera, which is you know the imager, the the rear controller and uh, recorder, and the viewfinder, under 60k. Okay. And the complimentary two-thirds inch uh, camera for sports and action, same combination would be under 55K. Okay. Now in terms of ISOs with the camera, uh, have you announced what range the camera should be in by the time it's released? Uh, we haven't announced all this okay. information yet, I and mean, we'll be shipping in the fall, and we'll you know, be coming out with, uh, you'll start hearing more information in the coming months on uh, final packages, pricing, uh, specification. Um, we've announced dynamic range at you know, 14 plus stops, right. but you'll hear, you'll hear more and more specs and information in the uh, coming months. Okay, excellent, thank you. Yeah. And, for, and for more information, uh, uh, you can go to www.panasonic.com slash broadcast.